Yo, no rap this week. I want to keep it unique so that you don't expect it, but I appreciate the suggestions. I'll keep this intro short and stop the delay and let's talk about shoes after the intro starts playing. <laughs> Yeah, welcome to the Heat Check. I am Jacques Slade, and this week kicks off with some more love from the brand created by the brother of Adi Dossler, Puma. The brand has been doing a terrific job when it comes to their women's footwear, and this week they are stepping things up with a knit version of the Puma Fierce. I say that like it's the only one, but truthfully, there's three of these colorways dropping. There's a black pair, a white pair, and a blue pair, and that blue pair is really blue. Those will cost you $100, and you can grab them over at Finish Line. Keeping with the women, they have two really dope sock darts dropping today as well. Both of these are considered special editions of the shoe, and instead of that usual neoprene we see on the sock dart, it appears that they use Flyden on the upper. There are two colorways, a black and lagoon pair, and a ghost green mixed with hot punch pair. Again, these are only available in women's sizes, though they're super dope, and will cost you $140. $40. Keeping with that lifestyle angle, Nike Sportswear is bringing another dose of the special field version of the Air Force One this week. There are four pairs, two are rocking gum bottoms, which look dope, the black and the off-white pair, while the blue rocks a blue outsole and the brown pair rocks a black outsole. The styling on these is crazy. Prices are set at $165. Adidas Hoops has been crushing it lately with their sneakers, and one of the newest is the Dame 3, formerly known as the D-Litter line. For this pair this week, Adidas is going with a Rip City theme on the upper of the shoe, which shows love to the home team in Portland. The upper of the shoe is mostly white with black as the secondary color and scarlet as the accent. If you are looking for a great pair to ball in, you can grab these for $115. Keeping with Adidas, their collab with White Mountaineering has been getting some burn as well. There are a few shoes in the mix, all of which have been changed up just a little bit. From the NMD to the Campus 80s, you can grab those starting today. Bringing basketball back to the forefront, the Kobe AD line continues to push out new colorways. The latest rock in a mostly red exterior. The actual color is University Red and it mixes in black on the liner and on the outsole. Those will cost you 160 on Friday. Also dropping on Friday is a shoe that could be considered a classic, the Reebok Shack Attack. Once worn by the dominating center known as Shaquille O'Neal, the Shack Attack is returning in its OG colorway complete with that pump in the tongue. Look for those that cost you $160 over at finish line. Switching to Saturday, Under Armour is celebrating in the holidays with the Chinese New Year colorway of the Curry 3. The upper features a bright rocket red alongside a multicolored midsole and heel. Expect those to cost you 140. Also dropping on Saturday is the shoe that helped bring Chicago a sixth championship in the Jordan years, the Air Jordan 13. For this drop, Jordan Brand decked out the signature model in all black and gave it a name, Black Cat. And in case you didn't believe them, the insole actually has a drawing of a black cat's face on there as well. Finish Line will have these ready to go early Saturday morning and they will cost you $190. See, quick and easy this week, but enough to get you thinking about what you want to pick up. Be sure to check below for the links to all the shoes that I talked about in the video today. And be sure to turn on your notifications for this channel and give this video a thumbs up if you like what you see. I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line. And as always, guys, I appreciate you. I'll see you soon. Peace.